I'm Eva Moskowitz, the founder and CEO of Success Academies, and I'm delighted to invite you behind the curtain into a Success Academy school to see our magical school communities. Good morning, Annabelle. Good morning, morning Gabriella. Before I started Success Academy, I had been very involved in public education. I was chairwoman of the education committee and I spent about seven years on a quest to understand why the system was not delivering for children. I ultimately concluded that I should spend my energies trying to build an alternative. We decided to create schools from scratch because I feel it's so important to have great free public schools that revolve around critical thinking and really focus on the whole child's education so we can develop children's talents. It's a very innovative way to approach schooling. We have English language learners known as ELL kids. That means their native language is not English. We have special needs kids of a variety of disabilities. We have kids living in shelters. We have kids facing all sorts of challenges. And our job is no matter what the circumstance the child or family is in to provide a world-class education. So we opened the first Success Academy in Harlem. There were schools in Harlem that had been failing for decades. And this is a community that, just like every community across this country, deserves a great school. Unfortunately, in America, that is not the case. There are educational haves and have-nots. We at Success Academies do not believe that zip code should determine destiny. Schools have to be extremely joyful places and they have to be very, very rigorous and challenging places. Kids don't learn if you don't intellectually stretch them. We wanted to set a standard that was designed around critical thinking where kids could learn by doing worthwhile mathematical problems, science five days a week, chess, art, music. That's how you get kids to love school and learning. So much of school is designed from the adult's point of view to make it convenient for adults or easy for adults. We really wanted to honor childhood and children. Educational nirvana is really to take child and the children and put them front and center in schooling so that even if the children had the freedom to leave any time they wanted, they did not leave because it was so engaging and they loved learning so much and they got to get their hands dirty and experience learning. From the beginning, the idea of Success Academies was not simply to do one school, but was to create a replicable model, financially, instructionally, operationally, a model that felt very intimate to the teachers, to the children, to the parents. We don't believe that schools can be successful without the parents. We believe that we have to have an incredibly strong relationship with parents and families to create world-class schools. And so we are dependent on a very high level of parental involvement. I am delighted to welcome you to Success Academies where leaders, parents, teachers, and kids are redefining what is possible in public education.